Yo, what up? What's poppin'? Back at it again with another hip-hop video for y'all. And this is another question for y'all. And this topic has been discussed plenty of times because one of the members from the legendary rap group Brand Nubian, he's the one that started off this topic on Vlad TV where he was saying that white rappers are guests in hip-hop and... Like, he, he he's also the one that started up saying that Eminem is a guest. And Eminem actually agreed with Lord Jamar. Eminem agreed and, and stated that as a white rapper that he is a guest. But if you ask me, Eminem is a legend. To me, Eminem is not a guest in hip-hop. Eminem is legendary. But everybody is entitled to their opinion. And Eminem... He's a humble individual as a as a lyricist, as a white rapper. But the question that I have for y'all, and a lot of y'all wonder this too. A lot of y'all wonder why wonder why the reason you wonder the we you wonder the reason why hip hop doesn't respect white rappers. How come hip hop doesn't respect white rappers? Let's have a discussion about this. Chat with me. Engage with me. Drop me a comment in the comment section. If you a white rapper, feel free to tune in. You know what I mean? How come hip-hop doesn't respect white rappers? I'm going to give you my answer like I do as always. I mean, at the end of the day, when it comes down to hip-hop, hip-hop is black culture. Hip-hop is a black art form, and as a white artist, as a white rapper, you do have to be respectful. I mean, the main reason why hip-hop doesn't respect white rappers is because they're white. I mean, at the end of the day, hip-hop, it has brought a lot of people together, and it has brung a lot of, like, like, people it's brung like black people together it's brung white people together like because of hip-hop hip-hop is one of is one of the reasons why why people want to unite more but at the end of the day like when it comes down to white rappers like as a white rapper just because of the fact that you're white you really have to show the people what you're all about. I mean, as a white rapper, you have to work twice as hard as a black rapper because when it comes down to hip-hop, hip-hop rap music is a black man's game. And just like when it comes down to sports, like with hockey, you don't really see too many black people in hockey, but you see... You know, like with hockey, they say that hockey is a white man's game. Even with baseball, even with baseball, people say the same thing about baseball where they talk about saying that baseball is a white man's sport. But you do got like a decent amount of blacks that play pro baseball in the MLB. But yeah, that that's pretty much the main reason. And, and when it comes down to the hip hop culture, not wanting to respect a white rapper because they're white is that racist i mean yeah it it, it is but it, it it's just how it is and in, in, in the in the rap game it's just how it is in the hip-hop culture but i mean with, with all the white rappers that they have now in hip-hop i mean Hip-hop is becoming colorblind, but as a white rapper, you still have more obstacles to face because of the fact that you're a white, that you're a white guy, that you're a, 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 a white person in a black man's game, in a black person's game. But at the end of the day, I mean, if you ask me, do I listen to any white rappers? Yeah, I do. To tell you the truth, there was a point of time where it seemed like with the white rappers, the white rappers were the ones that were spitting and the black rappers were the ones that were mumbling. Me, I'm a black rapper, but I will... I, yeah, I, 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 can, I can never, ever mumble rap. I will not... I will not mumble rap. I mean, with all the stuff that I've been through, as much as I love music, as much as I love hip-hop, as much as I love lyricism, I could never, ever mumble rap. You know what I mean? I And that's another thing, too. Like, I have to be myself. Like, as a hip-hop artist, I would never, ever do a music video where I'm waving guns in the music video. Like... 
See, see that right there, when you the type of rapper that be waving guns in your music video, you, you're, you're pretty much like a target. I mean, see, that's the thing. The, the music industry works with the prison industry. But yeah, like, but yeah, hip hop. Yeah, that, that's one of the pretty much one of the main reasons. Like, like, like hip hop, hip hop pretty much created a stereotype. A lot of people are just tricked by stereotypes. The average black hip-hop fan is tricked by stereotypes where they talk about saying that white rappers can't rap. It's all a stereotype. That's a stereotype. Jack Harlow can rap. Token can rap. Eminem can rap. Machine Gun Kelly can rap. Action Bronson can rap. Yellow Wolf can rap. Now... Iggy Azalea, she, she was okay, but all those white rappers that I named, they can all rap, and I'm, and I'm fans of all those white rappers, but yeah, it, it's, it's just a stereotype, people are tricked by stereotypes, that's why white rappers don't get the credit they deserve, because the stereotype, white rappers can't rap, but yeah, I just wanted to share this video with y'all, chat with y'all, you know, just, you know, had another question for y'all. And again, if you a white rapper, feel free to engage with me. Feel free to chat with me. You know, I mean, let's have an open discussion about this. Don't forget, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell on my channel, comment, share, like the video. And again, my new song, The Black Community, it's on my YouTube channel and it's also on my SoundCloud. You can follow me on SoundCloud at Wally G. Let's run it up. Let's blow it up. Love y'all.